Governor Kristi Noem will extend an executive order that requires some South Dakotans to stay at home. That order includes people 65 and older who live in Minnehaha and Lincoln counties and those with chronic health conditions. The move comes as the state hits 2,000 positive COVID-19 cases. Governor Noem wants older residents in and around Sioux Falls to stay inside until May 11th. They're considered a vulnerable population for COVID-19 infection. Noem understands the move may be discouraging. She asks that they have friends and family run errands for them to help them with their grocery shopping, help them get things done so they can stay home uh, as we go through the spread of COVID-19 that's especially impacting these two counties in the state of South Dakota. State health officials report 84 new cases for a statewide total of 2,040, and a person from Gerald County has died from the coronavirus. State data show the majority of COVID-19 cases are in people from 30 to 39 years old. The state is now bringing in more support to help with contact tracing to determine the spread from positive cases. Employees from the Department of Health and other state agencies, as well as the National Guard, are making those calls. Kim Malsom Risden is the secretary of the state health department. She says more than 130 workers will talk to people who test positive for COVID-19 to determine who they may have contacted. We've got a multitude of different people working on different aspects of this. Um, and um, feel very good about uh, the training that we've been able to put into place so that we can maintain those, those efforts. They're going to be critical as we move forward. The state is reporting 61 people are currently hospitalized with COVID-19. 10 people have died. For South Dakota Public Broadcasting, I'm Lee Strubinger in Rapid City.